And hey there, I'm your friend with Gaming Play Gaming HT, and today I'm doing a Terraria tutorial. Yay! It's not like I've been doing glitch tutorials or anything. No, no, I haven't. So this tutorial, I will show you how to defeat every boss a simple way. It's not as simple as other ways, but it's an easy way that you can even earn a bunch of money off. So basically, pl place a chest down or a safe. I mean, put whatever you want in here. Even put stone locks. Now, when you main menu. Crap, I've got to set my spawn. I will spawn somewhere else, like in a snow area. Um, so, basically, it, obviously, I've told you this before in my previous video, that it's the ID codes, and that an ID code is equal to, I don't know. So, basically, 325 stone blocks. I think the, the ID code for that is 5. So, 325 times 5. Hell of I know. <laughs> um, it's now... What the... It's now the doctor's shirt. I'm gonna keep this now. Lol. What does it look like? That looks pretty cool. Okay, whatever. So, it'll randomly give you stuff sometimes. Um, where the hell's the merchant? I don't play this world many often when I duplicate and glitch. So, a goal. So, yeah, see how much money I got from that? Now, I've done this way many times more than you. Ha! But, this is basically what I've gotten. I've gotten so much platinums. Wow. It's amazing. I've also lost a, almost a stack because I carry around a bunch of platinum, so I stopped. So anyway, this is what I have on me at this moment. So basically, grab a bunch of platinums, or whatever you want to do. Now go down to the gunpowder Gary, or whatever you would call go, 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 go! Now buy a bunch of cannonballs, but first you've got to buy cannons, but I've already, I'm one step ahead and I've already done that. I'll show you what to do afterwards. So buy a bunch of cannons. Like this. It's amaze balls. <laughs> amaze balls they are, really. So now, go all the way. Way! Go! Shh. It's my Nan guinea pig. Din, 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 din. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Just flying. It's crazy. So, anyway, I've one step ahead. I've uh, put together this, which basically. An obelisk. I don't care. So. You build in a small area, it's just this big. It's basically, you're gonna need wings to fly around because otherwise it won't work. You're gonna at least need one dragon armor. GO TO HELL! You're dead. Okay, I win. So now we have, we put the cannons down like this. You're gonna need at least a bunch of room. And then face them up, directly up like this. And now, basically, if you're battling any other mob slash boss, that doesn't involve, like, as soon as you die, you lose it. Basically, just set your spawn here. Say the ochre and all the twins. You don't instant They don't instantly disappear as soon as you die. So I'll be right back as soon as night falls. So then I can demonstrate on how and what happens. Okay, we are back. Um, I built that little barrier a while ago. To try and save myself from the wolves. But, here we go. This is how we, this, this is how we do it in Funky Town. Just bring it on, bro. Bring it on. Bring it on. So basically, you just run around and do this and keep like strafing. He will hit you a couple times. That's why if you have the wings, you can fly up, get him out of your sight, go back down and hit him again. And if having a healing potion, you can also heal. But this is what I do. I built that, which is really good, really helpful. You're gonna need at least 300 of these, at least. I used at least 200 at one point. It's sometimes it gets really annoying when they keep attacking you. Oh, I think they're mine that keep hitting me. Oh no, they're not. See, if you continuously do this, he will take damage to this, and he will die. Having a good trigger finger, I'm about to die, I did not notice. So basically, when you get to this point, you basically just want to run around and make sure you don't die. So just fly around, make sure you don't die. Hopefully you can see my character. Oh god, I'm over the barrier of doom. Stupid Wraith, what the heck? So I don't have any potions on me, unfortunately. Don't. 
Attack me, please. I'm very low. Whoa, that was close. <gasps> no, 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 no. Whoa, that was close. So basically, this is what you do. This is how I defeated Skeletron Prime from the first time, legitimately. Well, I actually never defeated him. Uh, did he vanish? No, he didn't. I was going to say. And he's gone. So this is basically how you do it. And yeah, I'll basically show you some more footage of me battling some other mobs with this tactic. See, look, notice I've used at least 100 of the uh, 100 uh, cannonballs. So yeah, I will speak to you after I show you the footage. See ya, bye, au revoir, whatever you say, Gaming HT out.